watch now a stunning announcement from Beyonce's father. Matthew Knowles says he's been treated for breast cancer. And while, they met that, while that may sound surprising, CBSN New York's Dr. Max Gomez tells us that men can and do get breast cancer. Matthew Knowles made his announcement during an interview with Michael Strahan on Good Morning America. What I want to share, Michael, is that I also am a survivor of breast cancer. It started two months ago when Knowles noticed a little blood on his shirt, even though he hadn't been scratched or injured. And then I told my wife, and she says, you know what, I saw a dot of blood on the sheets. So I immediately went to my doctor, I got a mammogram, and then it was very clear that I had breast cancer. That led to an analysis of the discharge from his breast, a mammogram, and the breast cancer diagnosis. And while that was surprising to many, the chief of breast surgery at Lenox Hill Hospital says Knowles' case is pretty typical for male breast cancer. It may present as a hard mass, hard irregular mass. It may present with some retraction of the nipple, which means the nipple being pulled in. And occasionally it can present with nipple discharge. Dr. Lauren Cassell says that the treatment for male breast cancer is virtually identical to that for women, surgery, radiation, and often chemo. The survival rates are also the same for similar stages, although male breast cancer is often found at a more advanced stage because men and their doctors often don't think of breast cancer when these signs and symptoms are found. Should the male or the, the patient or man notice a change in the breast, bring it to the attention of their physician and make sure that it's followed up upon. Again, Dr. Cassell says if men have any of those warning signs, they should see their doctor and suggest cancer. Knowles also had genetic testing, and it was found that in fact he does have one of the so-called breast cancer genes. That mutation also puts him at greater risk for pancreatic and prostate cancer. Dr. Max Gomez, CBSN, New York.